वेलकम टू इंजीनियरिंग फंडा फैमिली दिस वीडियो इज अ पार्ट ऑफ माइक्रो प्रोसेसर एट जीरो एट सिक्स वीडियो लेक्चर सीरीज एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई बी गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू डॉस इंटरप डॉस इंटरप मीन्स डिस्क ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम इंटरप माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स हियर विथ एट जीरो एट सिक्स वी हैव टोटल थर्टी नाइन डिफरेंट फंक्शंस विच इज एसोसिएटेड विथ डॉस सो टू एग्जीक्यूट दोज फंक्शंस we should be using dos interrupt and most commonly we use int space 21 hex instruction to execute all those commands which is there with dos how to call different commands of dos for that you will have to load ah register once you load ah register with appropriate data you can be able to call 39 different commands which are there with dos so how to have all those execution let us try to understand that step by step so my dear students dos provides various internal interrupt which are used by programmer and most commonly we are using int21 hacks so by using int21 hacks we can be able to call 39 different functions which is there with dos in 8086 here my dear students this interrupt invokes inbuilt dos functions those functions can be input character or input string it may be output character or output string here there are many other functions like terminate the program like you want to save the file like you want to open the file like you want to read the file like you want to rename the file so likewise there are many dos functions that we can work with 8086 for that you will have to use int space 21 hacks interrupt now my dear students here before you call dos interrupt you will have to assign value to ah register first and based on the value which we load it in ah register different functions can be called for dos interrupt i'll show you how to call that here my dear students you should know ah register will call different functions of dos interrupt and you will be observing almost 39 functions that i have seen which is working with 8086 here you cannot remember name of all the functions so here what i'll be doing is i'll explain you few examples in which how many functions that most commonly used by students while they program 8086 so here my dear students i have listed few functions only there are 39 functions available for 8086 like as if you load ah with 01 hex then here you can have input character from screen as if you load ah by 02 hex value then you can display character on screen as if you load ah with 0a hex then you can input string from the screen and as if you load ah with 09 then you can display string on screen by using ah is equals to 4c hex we can terminate the program and to create file open file close file there are various values that is there with ah my dear students do not worry about this you don't need to remember all these numbers right as if you want to execute this int 21 hex then you should have a table in which what value should be loaded in ah based on that you will be observing functions will be there right so for that you don't need to remember all the values here only you should know this four values for input character for display character as well as for input string and for display string you should be loading ah as per 01 02 0 a and 09 hacks respectively so these are the things that you should remember the reason is this is what you will be using it very frequently while you write the program right so let me give you some examples so that you will be having proper idea about how we will be using int21 hacks so my dear students here let us have input character example so for input character ah that should be loaded by 01 hex so you see here i have written input character is having command as per ah should be equals to 01 hex 
So first of all, I'll be writing move a h comma 0 1 hex. So what I'm doing is I'm loading a h by 0 1 hex. After that, as if I execute int 21 hex, then what will happen? Then there will be pop-up window that will be there in front of you. In that, you will have to enter one character. So from your keyboard, you can enter any character or any switch. And based on that, what will happen is that ASCII value of that character that will get stored inside AL register. And here, for example, as if you press small a or capital A, based on that, AL will get loaded. For example, if I have capital A, in that case, 65 is ASCII value of that. And in terms of hacks, it will be 41 hacks. For example, if you press control key, then AL will be equals to 00, zero hacks. So likewise, whatever button that you press, that button's ASCII value that will get loaded inside AL register. So we can input the character and answer will get loaded in AL register, right? As per move a h comma 0 1 hex after that you'll have to execute int 21 hex let me give you one more example for example if you want to display character then you'll have to load a h is equals to 0 2 hex so you see first i'm writing move a h comma 0 2 hex after that whatever character that i want to display that should be there in dl register so move dl comma character now here this character could be a, b, c, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, comma, semicolon, whatever you want to have that you will have to mention it over here. After that once you execute int 21 hex, then one pop-up display will appear in which that character will get displayed, which is there in DL register, right. So this is how we can display character for that first you will have to load a h by 0 2 then character should be there in dl register and then execute int 21 hacks let me give you a few more examples like you want to input string so to input string a h that should be loaded by 0 a hacks right so first of all move 0 a hacks into a h then my dear students you will have to load effective address of dx register and here first of all you should define string in your program and the label string that will be loaded effectively inside dx so now dx will be one pointer that will be pointing string right after that when you execute int 21 hex then pop-up window will appear in that pop-up window you will have to input string and once you input that string, then at this address, which is indicated by dx register, whatever string that we are loading, that will be appearing in terms of ASCII value, right? So now dx will be pointing string from data segment. So you should know, my dear students, now dx is a pointer, which is pointing string. And once you enter this int 21 hex, pop-up window will appear in that whatever string that you load that will be appearing at this pointer's address, right, which is dx pointer. How to display string? For that you have to load a h by 0 9 and as if you have string well defined in your program, then you will have to load that in dx register and after that once you execute int 21 hacks, you will be displaying whatever string that you have mentioned in your program, right? So string will get displayed. Like for example, if you write hello word by defining string over here, right? Then you just need to load that in dx and then execute int 21 hex and you will be displaying that string, right? For example, as if you want to terminate the program, then you just need to load h by 4c hex and then execute int 21 hex all you will be doing is you will be terminating program so my dear students there are another 39 functions which is there with dos 
along with 8086 for that you should be loading particular code in AH register after that execute INT21 hacks and then you will be observing various functions which is there with DOS interrupt. So this is all about this video still if any confusion is there what I want is you just post that in comment box so that we can have discussion on it. Thank you so much for watching this video.